टाइटल है संघर्ष It is so refreshing to hear the author, my friend, once my rival. We began a journey almost at the same time. He was making he had made a part of it, and then he was making Yenazdiki, and I was making art. He was the the biscuit from London, and I was the uh, nipped in the bud. Young uh, Zafar the Terrible, yeah. <laughs> who was uh, dust, junk in the dustbin of history, till somehow uh, I managed to survive uh, the fire that they had already arranged for me, uh, the industry. This, the industry is to keep the right people's opportunity. Uh, and somehow I survived that and made art. So we were, in a way, uh, 
rival them. But there's another person, a memory that holds us together, is, a, is an extraordinary human being called Jay Dixit, who was my professor at St. Xavier and the Noji's writer. Uh, so we, in a way, have been uh, strangely stitched together. So when Amit Khanna, my friend, came to me and said that there's a book launch and the Lord wants you to come, I said, of course, it is his right that I should be here on the platform. And you have been a book friend You see, I will have to go back. Nostalgia is very important in life. Dikshit ji and I saw at the Dimple Theatre. Trial finished at about 3, 3.30 or something like that. Boot lagi was in the school. And we are coming down Pali Hill, I could not hold myself. I could not hold I am angry with you, I am jealous of you. How dare you make such a beautiful thing? Is that right or not? In the evening, we met each other again at Samanaji's uh, place. And my God, was so angry with me. Come into my house to tell me this. I won't do this. How, you have to be, you know, he was very, very complimentary, very uh, warm about it. I was so honest about it. So I have two mics now. <laughs> So the point, the point is that uh, that when the, uh, he asked me to come, and I think it was really important that I would heartily embrace this this invitation. So thank you for this honor. And there's something you said there that this writing has become your refuge. I think this is the most uh, truthful uh, confession that you have made because. They say writers write either with an overflowing heart or from a heartbreak. When your heart is broken, you write, or when you are after overflowing with some kind of an unexplainable experience of life which has invaded every bone of your being, which seeks expression. And I think uh, most of the books that are there on the shelves and only the shelves were written by people that, who use writing as a refuge. Uh, because most of the time, human beings write to escape from the unexplainable mystery of life and the certainty of death, which is staring at all of us. So, the written word is man's right, last combat against insignificance. Uh, we all know that we are transient creatures, that we flash through the skies of life, of, of life the dark skies of life, light it up for some time, depending on the power that we have in our DNA. But ultimately, uh, we fade out and leave the memories that you once existed. And writers leave their footprints on the sands of time. So this is our last desperate attempt to stay relevant. We, you know, we, all of us fight transients because we know that the culture chews us and spits us on the sidewalk and ask for more. Uh, but I think that's what makes us so unique. Uh, I say us because I'm also a writer who writes, uh, has used the written word as uh, my tool of communication because I know the bandwidth of Hindi cinema or television doesn't give you that privilege to express some very subversive, very complex uh, views which you can do uh, within uh, with a written word. So I think you will find uh, the romance with writing has just begun. And I think it will, the way you have embraced it, I'm certain that you will delve into spaces which you perhaps never knew existed. And um, that's where uh, the storytellers actually uh, take a leap and uh, I'm certain that you are on the threshold of something unique. I see Ekbar Pir of Vinod Pandey, a new Vinod Pandey emerging from what you think 
is the dead end. Because what you see as a dead end is in fact nothing but a new beginning. And I come to applaud you and say that you're a brave man to make this new beginning. Because you are the master of this journey. With no financer, no distributor, no star to breathe over your shoulder to, and to dictate to you what should be the next word you should punch into your computer. It's you and you alone who are going to be the person who's going to decide that. And I think this is perhaps the greatest phase of your life where you are really tasting absolute and total freedom. But we have to be very, uh, very, very uh, uh, grateful to people, our publishers, who in this age and time, when they, you know, when everything is being reduced to 140 characters of Twitter, and the, the attention deficit disorder is a reality where we have entered the digital age and where you still find these kind of marvelous bookshops. I think uh, it's very brave of the publishers to, you know, to, to, to make huge investments in uh, storytellers. And it's a relationship which has always been a complex one. I hope you both make this marriage work for a very long time. And from your smile, I'm certain this is going to work for a very long time. Thank you very much. We had another comment. Oh, yes. Ah, there isn't a dull moment when Bhatsav is around. Thank you so much, sir. Reading from the portions of the book Savi, the story of Kontaban. Let me share Mr. Singh Gupta's profile with you first. Mr. John. Stop for a moment, please. There was an intense quiver in her voice. Why? Lana also stopped, and while trying to figure out the expression in her eyes, he teased. What happened? Manna jati hai. You want to die? Hi. She let out a deep sigh, and then mewled romantically like a young girl in love. Absolutely. I sure feel like that. Lana turned away from her, bursting into an uncontrollable laughter. <laughs> She persisted. Just turn your face this way, Ranaji. She had a dreamy softness in her eyes. Rana obliged and stared at her searchingly. After a moment's gaze in his eyes, she held his face in her hands and claimed his lips. It was a wholesome kiss deeper into the mouth, ripe with feelings. As she withdrew slowly, her voice quivered with emotion, saying, You have changed me completely, Ranaji. Yeah. It was a beautiful race. Print of Titan Ray, Mr. Francisco, Rushan, and the team of the dedicated. <laughs> 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 Okay, sir. Thank you. Sir, sir. 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 A transition from the world of images and sound to the written word. It's a moment to celebrate because what he actually clamors for is more freedom to express his deepest thoughts, which he perhaps cannot find in the space of cinema uh, that exists in the time that we live in. I see Vinod making a new beginning. This man who hit the headlines years back with Ek Baar Phir is making another beginning. This is a, the Ek Baar Phir journey of the writer who's going to use words and climb to unimaginable heights. So I've come here to Thank congratulate you. him and applaud him and seek inspiration from him to go on and on and on till we burn out. Yes, sir, today is the first, first day movie related to DSND. What kind of uh, response is getting from the fans of Bollywood? Well, I do not know what kind of response is getting, but I saw the film yesterday and I was staggered 
by Gauri's work. I was awestruck by Alia and Shah Rukh. I have never seen him on the screen the way he has emerged in this particular film. It's an out-of-the-box film. It's a very brave film. It's a film that makes Indian cinema proud. It's a new turn into a zone which is going to bring many surprises. Many new filmmakers will now speak this kind of a language. Sir, recently the Ranveer Singh promoted Jack and John's brand, Jack and John's jeans, in a sexiest way. You know, is necessary to go out of the way to go. Music started. Sir, 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 please, please. Sir, 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 what is your take on that? Is it necessary to this or do this kinds of sexiest way to promote a brand of a jeans? Is it necessary? Well, I have no reason to put any Lakshman Rekha on anybody's way of living life or doing things or thinking. But if your society has laid down certain rules and norms, then they, people in my industry are well advised to stay within the space that is allocated. Otherwise, you'll have to face the music of the forces that control our lives these days. Thank you so much. Do you want to see this book's story in this film? Look, when I was reading the scenes, I thought that I would talk to Pooja Bhatt that Jason Tree is going to take the story from here. Okay, thank you so much.